Welcome back everyone, we're going to be going over the great processing unit. So you can either buy the one on the map if you're in a base game map for Elm Creek, it's right over here. In order to purchase it, you'll just come over here to this little wrench and you can purchase it for 80000 Now if you want to have one on your own land, wherever you want it at, you can go into the build mode here. Come over to productions, go down to factories and then scroll over until you find the grape right here it is and it's 80,000 the same price and you can place it wherever you want on the map so this is where your actually let's go this is where you'll dump in your grapes at right here and then you can either produce raisins or grape juice and this is where your raisins and grape juice will spawn out at now you can come into the options menu here and go down to production chains to access this or you can just come up to the little wrench here at the door and as you can see we were making raisins and we ran out of grapes it takes a ton of grapes to make raisins by the way guys or you can make grape juice so if you want to activate something you just hit X on it or you if you want to deactivate it you can hit X on that so right now it says status inactive we'll activate raisins again and it says it is running so let's go ahead and unload these grapes you just back up to this little point right here and they'll dump out the back of the trailer so now we have grapes running as you can see it is working it's going to cost you five dollars a minute and it'll do 15 cycles per minute so it's a little costly compared to the other ones let's go ahead and jump the time up a little bit just to get on with the video so as you can see it is rolling through it it's not making a ton but we're making some hopefully we'll have enough i think it'll be a thousand liters and a, a pallet will spawn out we're getting pretty close. We should have enough. There we go. We had just enough for one pallet to pop out. And here you have your raisins. Now you cannot lift these up by hand. You will have to use a forklift or a skid steer or telehandler, front end loader with a pallet fork, anything like that. But once you once you get your raisins or your grape juice what are you going to do with them so if we come in here you always can just sell it off obviously you can sell off your raisins or you can sell off your grape juice but for the grape juice or the raisins I mean you can take the raisins a little bit farther so as you can see you can sell off raisins for 4,300 or you can take them to the cereal factory so if you take them to the cereal factory let me grab my sheet here so the cereal factory you can take raisins oat honey and corn and you can make cereal so if you don't have the corn honey and oats you can just sell them off for three thousand or four thousand i mean and then if you make grape juice you can't produce that any farther you can just go ahead and sell off the grape juice for right around four grand so it's pretty profitable actually and make a decent amount of money definitely definitely recommend checking into some production chains it's a good way to um, farther your crops and have more fun playing the game because you know you don't want to just harvest crops and then sell them you can go ahead and make a ton of different things if you haven't yet check out my other videos on production chains and if you found this video helpful, make sure you go ahead and leave a like on it. And I think that's all that we have for today. So we'll see you guys on the next one. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and take a look at the video and playlist up on the screen. This has been CNS Farms. Thanks for coming and watching.